Hello, Dana Smithers here, author of Law of Attraction Gratitude Journal. Attract more of what you want to create a happy, abundant life. So we're in week six of my 52-week Law of Attraction Journal. And week six, week six says the Law of Attraction's job is to match vibrations. Now, if you've been watching my other videos, you know that um, this is the only job that the Law of Attraction has. It doesn't care whether you're male, female, thin, have a little bit more weight on, um, have red hair, have black hair, have blue hair, green eyes, wear certain color clothes. It's no respecter of your person. The law of attraction is just obedient to your vibrations. So you know you, you can have a negative vibration or you can have a positive vibration. You can never have two vibrations at the same time. You can't have positive and negative at the same time going on. It's impossible. Just the same way you cannot have two thoughts going on in your head. You can only have one thought at one time. As soon as you think you've got two thoughts, then you've switched to another thought. So the same with Law of Attraction. If you haven't already um, subscribed to my newsletter or signed up to get um, this book, The Law of Attraction, it's an ebook, The Power of Your Words. Um, I highly recommend that you do because it is, it's kind of Law of Attraction 101. It shows you that everything starts with your words. And from your words, just think of it like you had a big dictionary and you shake it into a box, okay? So in there you've got all these words in, in your box. And then from these words you form thoughts. And these thoughts that you have positive or negative, are then going to give you a certain feeling. So if I have a positive thought, like today I can say, ooh la la, I um, love that I'm wearing uh, my favorite earrings. I got these up at um, uh, Sparkling Hills uh, Spa and Resort, where I was actually doing talk on the Law of Attraction, and they had a gift shop, and I treated myself to these. So I have a very positive thought going on. Right now, give me a very positive feeling. So my result is that I get pure enjoyment from wearing these earrings. So again, we just go back to the Law of Attraction's job is to match your vibrations. So when I was up there at the spa, it's a little, it's still in the same province I live in, but you know, about four hour drive. So, all right, so I bought the earrings and then, so I was feeling really happy. And then uh, from there, I kept the vibration going. We went and um, had lunch with some friends and it was fun. And then we drove back and we had a good try time driving back. It was kind of in record time as well. We didn't break any speed limits, but it was fun. And uh, the positivity just kept going. So I love that because I know that the law of attraction's job is just to match vibrations. So if you've got something um, negative going on. Well, if you were here, you could answer the question for me. What happens when you've got a negative vibration going on? Law of Attraction matches it with another negative vibration. And that's how you get spiraling down. And I like to say to people, even though you're going to go, you know you're going to go into that rabbit hole, there is no carrot cake. There's no carrot cake down in that rabbit hole. So get in there briefly, have your hissy fit, your meltdown, whatever you need to do, but bring yourself back up to the top so that you've got a high vibration going on and the law of attraction can match it and just gives you more of that. So that is how, that's one of the 101 uh, law of attraction rules. That's a universal principle. Whatever you're putting out there is what is what is going to be matched out there. So from the it's from the inside out. So if you're feeling not very good, not having a good day, and I advise you sometimes if you're not having a good day, then just acknowledge it. Give yourself permission to not have a good day. Maybe you need to read a book or maybe you just need to be quiet or maybe you just need to have a time out. It's whatever works for you because we don't we're not always 100% positive. I don't know anybody actually who is 100% positive, um, but the point is, you know, we're human, so life is going to happen to all of us. But it's it's how you respond to it, and when we react to things, oftentimes we tend to to it tends to be a negative reaction. So if you give yourself just a minute to think about what your response is to something, then you are in fact 
responding to it rather than reacting. And chances are that's going to have a higher vibration for you. And the law of attraction is going to match that bright vibration and give you more of the good same things. And you probably notice that, um, you know, maybe it's one of those days you get up in the morning and, you know, you spill your coffee on your blouse or your shirt and you go out and someone doesn't hold the elevator for you or you're getting a car and it's just bumper to bumper traffic and all you can think of is, you know what, I should have stayed in bed. And maybe you should have. But you do have the opportunity to remember that snap, change that vibration by asking that question, so what do I want, right? We're resetting that vibe. And once you reset that vibe, then the law of attraction is going to match that vibration. But, you know, be kind to yourself. If you need to have a day in or a day off or just uh, me time, um, take it but enjoy it, right? So the law of attraction can give you more of that because sometimes when we rest a little bit, which sometimes entrepreneurs tend not to do, take good care of themselves, it's okay. Self-care is not selfish. It's smart. Yeah, so just remember, law of attraction job is to match your vibration. So the more vibrations you can have at a higher frequency, the more you're going to attract.